Hey guys, so in this video I'm going to take a look at these uh, tiny Racer Star motors. They are the, the 1104 4000 KV and these are similar to the ones that come from DYS. I happen to have the DYS version here but this one is a 5400 uh, KV version so this one's going to be a little bit uh, better performing than this one which is only 4000 KV and additionally uh, the racer star motor according to the spec sheet is only rated from 1 to 2S and um, uh, the DOIS is rated up to 3S although I've heard reports of people running this on 4S I'm uh, planning on using these guys on my uh, Mosquito 110 build here and uh, we'll see how they do. Those are just going to be running uh, small two and a half inch propellers so I'll probably do 2S at first and then I'm pretty sure this will probably be okay on 3S so um, we'll, be doing, we'll be testing that. Uh, the, comparing these two motors next to each other you can see they're very similar. They have the one and a half millimeter uh, motor shafts with the uh, T-style prop using the M2 screws to secure the props. Uh, you can see that there's a slight difference here in the DOS. There's uh, six spokes and there's only five on the Racer Star. From the side they look very similar in terms of height. And the bottoms and the bottoms also look very similar as well. It's pretty hard to get the camera to focus on the windings, but they also look fairly similar as well. And we have a standard C-clip and a bearing underneath there that also looks pretty similar. So even though this Racer Star motor is only rated to 2S, I'm pretty sure it'll be fine on 3S, but I guess we'll find out. It does come with a bag of screws. You get the, the bigger ones here for the securing of the propellers and these smaller ones for securing to the frame although I don't really like the style of screw here the DOS also comes with that same style screw with the sort of the um, tapered edges there and I don't think that that's a, a good a good screw so I'm going to be using my own so the uh, racer star motor comes in at five grams it, in the spec sheet it says it's five and a half grams so that's about right and the DOS also comes in at five grams. Not surprising. The motor wires on the Racer Star are pretty thin, and it's pretty normal for the size of the motor. They're not as long as the ones that come on the DYS, but you really don't need super long wires anyway. Um, the plastic, I think this is like a plastic material that's on the DYS motors, uh, the motor wires and the ones in the racer star actually are silicon they at least they feel that way so um they, they should be a little bit more durable than the plastic ones tend to break down after a while anyway guys just a quick look here at these uh, 1104 motors from racer star i'm going to be putting these on the mosquito here and you'll be seeing those uh flying around in a future video so stay tuned for that let me know if you guys have any questions in the comment section below and i'll talk to you guys in the next video